If you haven't heard the news, GTA 6 has leaked due to a hacker. The same hacker who apparently has hacked Uber also hacked Rockstar's system to get a lot of videos leaked out, which are Grand Theft Auto 6 in development. Now, a lot of people are pretty displeased with this because it doesn't look that good. So we're going to talk about that. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. As much as I'd love to show leaked footage, I'm pretty sure this video will get striked down. I mean, I'm sure at some point in time, everyone and their mom's going to be posting some type of leaked footage, but just to be on the safe side, I, I don't really want to do that. So regardless of your opinion on leaking or hacking or whatever with video games, it happened. Now, a lot of people are saying that because of these leaks, GTA 6 is going to be pushed back. It's really, really bad for people to leak things like this. And genuinely, overall the developers are going to be treated badly because of this and I have to say one I don't feel bad for Rockstar at all yes the hacker should be punished they will likely be caught and prosecuted if they're in the country that does that sort of thing but the fact of the matter is Rockstar milked GTA 5 for 10 fucking years okay in that time span there's so many games they could have remastered re-released Bully Bully 2 they could have uh, put out the OG Red Dead Redemption remastered. They could have supported Red Dead Online. Um, even the Grand Theft Auto 5 online portion has issues with a lot of hackers, modders, and cheaters. So to say that I feel bad about a company that has one of the best selling games of all time, they, they're raking in money hand over fist and they have ridiculous microtransactions available for you to purchase on GTA 5. Yeah, I don't really feel bad. The second part of this is a lot of people are decrying the developers will be treated bad badly because of this. Who gives a fuck what someone on the internet says about you if you work for Rockstar when you're making Grand Theft Auto? They've made fantastic Grand Theft Auto games. So who, who fucking cares what some kid on Twitter is saying, oh, it doesn't look good, or this big YouTube. Who fucking cares, man? The game's not even out yet. It's not finished. So do I truly believe the developers will be treated badly? No. And if they are, that's a black eye on Rockstar. They, that sh they shouldn't do that. Rockstar should have had better security, along with Uber, so that things like this wouldn't happen. And atop that, if the game's not finished, it doesn't matter. A lot of people are disappointed with it, but we don't particularly know exactly what build or what complete state these games are in right now, uh, because the leaker is just somebody who hacked and leaked footage. So this isn't even the company coming out and saying, oh yeah, this game's done, check it out, look at it, and everyone being disappointed. Long story short, uh, I would assume that big companies would have learned from the Sony fiasco back in the day and would have tightened up security, but no, no. Yet again, we still have the same problems, the same issues that will always plague gaming. Leakers, hackers, and things like that. But if you're feeling bad for a company that has milked the same game for 10 years, just remember, just think to yourself, should I feel bad for a company that won't feel bad for me? Hey, that'll do it for the biggest story for this week. I really appreciate you guys tuning in. You make sure to click that subscribe button, a like and share the video, and tell everybody that I exist because it's most important to let people know that I'm still around. Yes, I do Pokemon theories, but this is my dedicated news channel. And Poke Stuff 151 is the Pokemon theory channel. There's, of course, Proto Mario, which is just a meme channel where I put out interesting stuff. And uh, there's another channel called CRT TV if you're interested in some unique reviews. I'll catch you on the flippity flip, folks.